Okay, listen up, fellas. <clears throat> the story of Tigger. When I first came to the forest, I was ready and raring to go. So? So I bounced and then I had breakfast. And? And that's the end. Oh. oh. Well, isn't that the greatest story that there ever was? And I can tell it to you on account of just because. That's the story of Tigger. That's the story of me. Cause I'm the one did it happen to. Cause that's who I happen to be. <laughs> that's the story of me. Uh, Tigger, do you think you may have left something out? Left something out? Well, remember when we surprised you? Oh, which time? Oh, the day that we thought it <gasps> would rain. Oh, no. And all the times that you bounced on my guard. Oh, I remember that. Now I see what you're saying. It's the story of Tigger. And it's the story of Pooh. Of me. And the story of Little Piglet. The story of Floppy Ears, too. The story of me and of you. Uh, the story of us. That's the story of Tigger. <laughs> That's the story of me. And I couldn't have done it without you guys. The best friends there ever could be. Who else would stay right here and let me bend their ear and tell the story of me? Without friends like you, I don't know what I'd do. That's the story of Tigger. That's the story of me. Come on, fellas. There's lots more to this story. Take it from me. From here on in, it stays full of pouncing and bouncing and mispronouncing.